सो दिस इज अ गेट टू थाउजेंड एंड फोर क्वेश्चन इट्स फॉर वन मार्क लेट्स रीड इट विच अ ड्रेसिंग मोड इज सुटेबल फॉर प्रोग्राम रीलोकेशन वट इज प्रोग्राम रीलोकेशन प्रोग्राम रीलोकेशन मीन्स वेन ऑपरेटिंग सिस्टम डिसाइड्स टू मूव योर प्रोग्राम हेयर एंड देयर इन रैम दैट मीन्स से अर्लियर इट वॉज लोडेड एट एड्रेस टू फोर्टी दिस इज टू फोर्टी वन देन टू फोर्टी टू टू फोर्टी थ्री सो ऑन नाउ ओ एस डिसाइड्स दैट दिस स्पेस मस्ट बी गिवन टू सम अदर प्रोग्राम एंड द दिस प्रोग्राम मस्ट बी मूवड टू सम अदर लाइन नाउ लेट से द न्यू एड्रेस वेयर इट गेट्स रिलोकेटेड इज सेवन सेवन फोर दिस इज प्रोग्राम रिलोकेशन नाउ फर्स्ट ऑप्शन इज एब्सोल्यूट एड्रेसिंग मोड एब्सोल्यूट एड्रेसिंग मोड से इज द ऑपर एंड फील्ड ऑफ आर इंस्ट्रक्शन दिस फील्ड इट कंटेन्स द एड्रेस ऑफ द ऑपर एंड दैट मीन्स दीज बिट्स आर द एड्रेस ऑफ ऑपर एंड मेमरी एड्रेस फॉर एग्जाम्पल इफ यू हैव मैंशनड वन जीरो वन वन जीरो हेयर दिस मीन्स द ऑपर एंड दैट वी वॉन्ट इज प्रेजेंट एट दिस लोकेशन इन मेमरी वन जीरो वन वन जीरो हेयर इज आर ऑपर एंड नाउ इफ यू सी दिस इज काइंड ऑफ लाइक हार्ड कोडिंग द टारगेट एड्रेस इरिस्पेक्टिव ऑफ वेयर आर प्रोग्राम गेट्स लोडेड इन टू रैम दिस वोट चेंज दिस इज हार्ड कोडेड इन टू आर प्रोग्राम और इन टू दिस स्पेसिफिक इंस्ट्रक्शन से दिस इज सेवन सेवन फोर दिस इज सेवन सेवन फाइव देन सेवन सेवन सिक्स देन सेवन सेवन एट द सेकेंड लाइन इज जम्प टू सेवन सेवन एट you want to skip this one line 776 must be skipped and you want to jump to 77 sorry this one is 777 and you want to jump to 778 these two lines must be skipped and you want to jump here so hard coding this value 778 into the instruction means Every time our program must be loaded at seven seven four only to make this work. Every time we need base address equal to seven seven four. That's the only way to skip these two lines. Say some day our OS decides to load this at hundred. This address is hundred. This is one zero one. This is one zero two. One zero three. One zero four. Now to skip these two lines. In this case. The address here must be one zero four, but we have hard coded seven seven eight, so this won't work. That means absolute addressing is not a very good choice here. Next one is based. So this I have already discussed in a video based addressing mode. You first see that I'll attach the clip here only, then come back. Base register addressing mode. This mode is useful for writing relocatable code. How? Say your program begins from address number zero inside the primary memory or RAM, and the second line is jump to four, which means you want to jump from this line to this line and skip these two lines. Okay, this works only if your program begins from address number zero. But what if this address is one hundred? This address is one hundred one. In that case, you need to jump to the address one hundred and four. But that way, every time when you load your program into the RAM, you need to know where is it loaded to make this change. Yeah, you need to write one hundred four here to skip these two instruction in case the program begins from hundred. Okay, that means say some other day your program is loaded from instruction. The first instruction is loaded to address three four three, 
then to skip these two lines you need to write something else here but a better solution is you assume that your program is always beginning from address number 0 okay you assume that it always begins from address number 0 so this one this address is going to be 4 and you take the addressing mode of this line to be base register addressing mode what that means is whatever is written here 4 you add it to the base address this is base address of this program for example you tried to run this program and OS decided it to start the execution from address number 117 that means your program is loaded from address number 117 now this is 107th line sorry 17th then 1118 1119 120 121 you need to jump here but you have written jump 4 using this addressing mode base register addressing mode what the processor is going to do it will add 4 to the base address and calculate the new address which is 117 plus 4 that comes out to be 121 that means wherever your program gets loaded into the RAM irrespective of that address you can always write jump 4 here to skip these two lines if you are using this addressing mode so this one is used in writing relocatable code relocation means when os decides to move your code here and there in ram that means the beginning address of your program is never known to you that is taken care of by os So next one is relative addressing mode. You have seen that this one is answer. Next is relative addressing mode. Relative addressing mode is of two types. Register relative and PC relative. Register relative means this address is relative to some register. PC relative means this address is relative to the current instruction number pc stores the instruction number rather the uh, address of next instruction now using this pc relative addressing mode to skip these two lines what you can do is you can write jump to three and specify that addressing mode of this instruction is pc relative that means whatever is the current instruction number Current instruction number is 775. From 775, jump to the third instruction. That means this one, which is equivalent to skipping this and this instruction. So these two instructions are skipped. Now whatever is the base address, means wherever the program gets loaded into the RAM, it is all, it will always be these two instructions that are skipped whatever their address may be they will always be skipped because now we are providing the address that is relative to the pc program counter now this may even be two three or two it's based on implementation like pc contains this address yeah when we are executing this instruction program counter contains the address of next instruction so from here we need to skip only two instructions okay or skip to the second instruction this is first this is second so if we write skip to or jump to two we come here so two or three anything will work that really depends upon the implement implementation but the thing is pc relative can suffice to the situation okay register relative is very similar to pc relative 
in register relative say we can save this base address so there is some register in which we save this base address wherever currently our program is loaded and relative to this base we provide the address for example here we need 0th 1st 2nd 3rd 4th we need to go to the 4th address so we write skip to 4 whatsoever be the base address it's saved in some register and we skip to fourth line from that from that base address that means target address in that in this case is this register plus address given in the instruction or it's also called offset sometimes four okay so next one is indirect addressing mode this also I have recorded uh, in say, maybe gate 2001 question. So you can see that this won't work. I'll attach the clip next. Okay. This, this addressing mode is mostly used for pointers. That is going to be the effective address. Say we have saved here 1111100. Now you go to this address and find the actual operand there. So say this address is here. 111100. And here you have saved the actual operand. It may be 39 say. That means whatever we are saving in this location location specified by the address given in operand field contains the address of actual operand yeah this con this contains the address of actual operand it looks very similar to the concept of pointers that's what pointers do for example you have saved a pointer here pointer itself contains the address it may contain this address We'll take an example, say int k is equal to 30 and int star ptr is equal to address of k. Now k is a normal integer variable and ptr is a pointer pointing to k. What that means, ptr is going to contain the address of k this location this one can be ptr and it contains the address of k this location can be k this location can be ptr say for example now ptr contains the address of k that's how pointers work so indirect addressing mode is very suitable for implementing pointers x matches to 2 